Uh, yo, this is uh, one of the. He is a calf and Lee, David Lee, a creative fighter. I think when we were selecting him, he was like a jujitsu specialist, some shit like that. So you already know he's probably gonna start spamming a bunch of takedowns, a bunch of submissions, or something along those lines. I actually never use. Uh, what is his guy's name? Uh, David Lee, something like that. Um, well, I used him once against my cousin. But anyways, the point is he has pretty decent striking. Like, like oh no, it's Lee Edwards, yeah. Anyways, he has really good striking, decent stamina, so that's when I went I went ahead and chose him. But I like his build, like he has a good uh, good wingspan, nice stance, good kickboxing style, so, you know, fits my style of play, basically. Yep. I have to know how to stop that takedown that he's straight into the half guard. There you go. <laughs> so right away, I mean, the first thing I'm thinking is, he's probably... He's probably gonna start spamming a bunch of takedowns, a bunch of ground game. So let me just relax on my back. Yeah, good turn. Go counter. Let me just relax, you know, manage my stamina and just pick him off as much as I can. He's gonna really have to do damage. Yeah. Uh, this is another thing that I don't know how to counter. That rubber guard into either a mount position or uh, side control. There you go, there go the first submission attempt. You're not gonna submit me, bro. <laughs> that gets real difficult to get that against me. Oh, he actually got the chain. Nice. You know, you take your time, relax. That's how you play the game. If you're here, I'm getting my stamina go all the way up. I'm not even worried about transitioning. He's gonna, that's fine. He's probably gonna do the same transition. I gotta learn how to stop that though. I don't know if it's left, right, down, or what. There you go. My goal is just basically either run his stamina down or, you know, just try to stand up. But for now, since I'm on my back, I'm just waiting patiently, letting him do transitions, and just try my best to stop it. You know, just let him wear his stamina down, maybe sneak a, a strike or two. Eventually he'll get frustrated. Like once he sees things is not working, there you go. That's what I really want. I don't really care so much about standing up so long as I stay on the full guard, land a couple of elbows, blast my stamina, and I'm only like throwing them once. Like once I see my stamina is full, that's when I throw an elbow. If it's not completely full, I'm not throwing an elbow. There you go. Trust me, man. That's uncomfortable, man. You just landing those elbows. They're so underrated. But them chest advantage. There you go. <laughs> I'll gladly stay in that position. Okay, we can stay there the whole game. I actually feel like I won it. There you go. We made him stand up. <laughs> Got uncomfortable. He just stood in the same position, didn't, trans didn't do a transition, so there you go. Oh, that goes to I don't know how the hell I didn't stop that takedown. It's cool. There you go. Just taking my time. 30 seconds, 30 seconds to go left. Here. There you go. All we gotta do is block. That's all we gotta do here. Nothing more. Yeah, he goes from missing attack. Yep. Let's see, he's gonna do an armbar with 20 seconds left. <laughs> Not submit. Every year they change the submission mechanics. So, you know, once you got it, once you learn it, you're pretty much good to go. Look at these stats. So, see, I landed 21 strikes, so it's 20, 21 out of 25 strikes, three significant, so it's one. He only landed nine or 15. He got two takedowns. Did nothing. Two minutes of control, two takedowns to land half of my strikes, and just one significant. Come on, man. <laughs> Definitely won that round. Well, at least I think I did. I'm not sure what holds weight. There we go. He's doing good too. I mean, he has his stamina. I got mine. But I'm pretty sure he's used to gassing people out with the takedowns. Let's see how this goes. As you can tell, you know, I don't know all of the moves for uh, Lee Edwards. Like, I probably could have done like a sidekick or something like that. I'm still trying to figure out how he plays. But. My goal is to work his body when he's striking, or whatever he can give me, really. Hey, man, good roll, okay. Good defense. Nice. Nice body shots right there. Mm -hmm. There goes the takedown. Oh, man. That's fine, but he could stay right there. Yep. 
Okay. Stamina back. We don't gotta tra uh, do a uh, transition. It's so easy to stop. There you go. Wait for him to swing. It's always easy for him to deny any transition from there, from that squirrel position. <laughs> but I kind of hate it. I mean, me, me personally. That's how I just waited. Gotta get better at this clean situation too. I always, I usually try to land maybe like a head, like a punch, a hook or something like that. Oh, no, he actually got the tape on this one. <laughs> Must be some type of fucking stamina boost. But well, I guess that's probably his build. That's fine. No need to panic. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these no type of panic. transitions and scrambles. He has me on the ground, but like he's doing literally jack shit. Like he's literally not doing anything. Under two minutes to go around two. Whereas, when we stand up, I do damage on him. Ah. Alright, I took I definitely took two bad hits right there. Alright, hm. side control now. Okay, get my stamina back, relax. Alright, he's very comfortable fighting go. off his back. DC now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Okay. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. I need a trend. There you go. Nice, nice, nice. That was great. Right, well, both fighters pretty comfortable great on the ground, DC, but you gotta be uh -huh. very careful Good. hanging out here for too long if you're his opponent. Hmm. There you go. I actually usually don't go for that one, but you know, you gotta be timely with those. Just gotta relax here, deny that, work his body. Oh, he's got the ground and pound going his body down. again. Deny he's that. Oh, I thought I denied it. Damn, I gotta, I gotta learn how to stop that transition. There you go. He feels like he's winning here. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Oh, nice combination of strikes here from the top, standing over his opponent. There you go. Elbow. Uh huh. Nice. Nice stop. Nice. 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 <laughs> I definitely won that round again. I feel. <laughs> Let's see. Five stats. Round two. Yep. Well, I landed one more strike. That was much better round for him. I think I still got the match. The winner of this round depends right here on this one. Hmm. He already missed one takedown. Head strikes on you. Okay. Oh, man. There you go. Definitely teeing off on him now. There you go. Alright, that's fine. That's cool. That's cool. We're gonna keep doing the same thing. Good up. Good up. You could burn a little bit of stamina now just because, you know. Yeah, yeah, keep doing your circles. There you go. If that's your game plan, buddy, that's just not gonna work. Sorry to tell you. <laughs> oh, there's a take down. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, I would have got him with that knee. What the hell is this? Oh, okay. Fine, no, boy. Nah, buddy. I'm <laughs> still not getting that. He's trying every submission known to man, and that shit is just not working. I couldn't have escaped any easier. <laughs> Honestly. Alright, full guard now, DC. Here we go. Here we go. Posture to throw ground and pound and then mm -hmm. move to the next position. But if you're on the bottom, you've got to build a shield. I, I figured I may as well posture up considering all the transitions he's doing. There you go. Showing off that Stop leg that. Okay. dexterity and flexibility rubber guard. Now. I mean, it's unbelievable. Ah, there you go. There you go. These guys who are able oh. to bring the legs all the way up around the shoulders Full guard. and just control you. Because for me personally, and I'm Body a shot. Jiu expert. Mm -hmm. To me personally, it feels like. For me, I could do body shots, but I think I should work more on his face, just so I could have a higher chance of getting a significant. Got another submission inside. This <laughs> is not working, and I stopped the stream. <laughs> this guy was really, really, really trying. <laughs> it's just not working out. It's just not. This is probably his best attempt, and even that, you see how easy they escape from this one. Stamina, another transition.
Close guard. <laughs> there you go. All right, bottom guard. Right here, maybe looking to hit He's getting up. DC. Damn it. I gotta, I don't know how to, I don't understand that. Like, that they do have a transition. Good stop. Thank you. <laughs> Strike with me. Bum, bro. It's like, you know, 40 seconds left, and at this point, I just playing defense. I feel like I won the fight. Literally, like, I'm asking to strike with this kid, and he's just not being receptive of anything. As you can tell, this guy's bad. All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Definitely wanted to sneak a hit in. Oh, man. Yes, sir. Look at that. Oh, man. Uh huh. Give me that. Come on now. Yeah, a little bit of striking. Smoke them right away. Usually, you know, I usually show respect, but this guy was just not. I watched the fight. I believe that he did enough. But when these fights are this close, it's razor, razor thin. Yeah, I definitely think you I won that one. For sure. What the judges are seeing. I see after that little exchange in the third round. It just wasn't enough of anything. That should get him the victory. So, but we shall see. with that being, you know, that being said, I feel like I landed more strikes considering there was really nothing done with the ground except like a bunch of submission attempts. Yep. Oh, it's Leon. <laughs> I kept saying Leon. Yep. Pretty much, man. Good position, and it's a tire defense. Let's go.